Hi everybody and welcome to Wendy's Creative Corner. I am here with a video response to Bethany who is BA Crafty Girl. She is hosting a Christmas winter holiday challenge and her challenge was to create a card and or tag or both for two entries into the um, drawing I guess. The project is due December the 5th and she, the requirements were to use two stamps, three stars, glitter, two die cuts and a video response for each project completed. Um, so I've gone ahead and completed a card <clears throat> for the challenge and excuse my voice I'm sick with another cold again. Um, I don't think I've gotten over the first one that I'm back at it all over again. But anyway having said that um, the pattern paper that I use is just a regular A2 size card and the pattern paper that I used um, for my card is the Lost and Found um, Christmas by my mind's eye designer paper and all the paper is backed on to just some cream card stock <coughs> excuse me um, the stamp sentiment and um, pure innocence is from the um, Holly girl Oops, sorry so I use the sentiment as well as the stamped image for my two stamps hopefully that qualifies Bethany because uh, it is the same stamp set um, I paper pieced her little dress and just used my Copics to color the rest of her in. I did use stickles um, for her little barrette and the berries and leaves for my uh, glitter and uh, I stamped my sentiment here. I've inked all the edges on my card using the walnut stain and I've got my two die cuts here. These are both from MFT, these banner, fishtail banners. Um, and they're just two different sizes. I also have a third die cut here which is my um, Spellbinders oval. <clears throat> and I just used a lot of dimension on this card and I popped her up as well as I popped up the oval. And then when you open up the card, it sits like that. And hopefully you guys can see that. I've used another die cut here and this is I believe from Hero Arts last year. Um, and it is, I just used some pattern paper to die cut that out. I used three stars here, and these are three stars, are for, they're balsa wood, and they're from Cat Scrappiness. And again, use stickles on the stars to create glitter. And then I've just got some pattern paper down below, and um, Marion Bright was already there on the uh, pattern paper. So, I think if I turn it this way, you guys will be able to see the whole card. <coughs> Let me just zoom out. There you go. So this is my completed card for Bethany's challenge. Um, I'm very pleased with the way it turned out. And um, I thank you, Bethany, for hosting this challenge. And good luck to everyone. And until the next time, we'll see you later. Bye now.